Selam nui in a quan de nam mutaicho. Time for a randomizer for the warm story. Okay, the one that just uh, appeared I might do that because it's. <laughs> and both of these stories seem cool. Okay, there's a juvenile one and then a juvenile delinquent one. The one that was just already on the page was the juvenile one. And then I, when I press, pressed random, I got the juvenile delinquent one. I know everybody is probably like juvenile delinquent one. Who knows? Maybe it's 50-50. Anyway, let's do the uh, <sighs> juvenile one. <sighs> this was in the good old year of jeez what what year could this be um 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 this must have been in grade like three or two so in grade three or two Anyway. I finished that cider. I'm s continuing a story from the story I just told about the bone thugs. So this is the <clears throat> maybe maybe you know no, actually that's gonna be in the title. So this is the poo in the pantaloons story of grade two or grade three. Now I'm a little lad. I'm a little lassie, and I'm like Miss Teacher. What's your name? I have no idea. I won't say your name. So, I go to the bathroom, and I'm like, I got to take the doo-doo. And taking a doo-doo in school at that time was like, the heck, yo. Too many kids come in and being ass faces in the bathroom all the time. Kids would look under the stall, jump over, smack like both stuff over like dude so i'm like yo i gotta go gotta take this poo before anyone comes in and i must have went who knows who knows what this teacher was thinking about she must have known she was like letting a billion kids in or maybe this was just like the bathroom break time because there's this time like we would all get up, the whole class, and just go to the bathroom. Like in a line. So I might might have just asked to go to the bathroom like a few minutes before we were all going to get up anyway. Like I had the poo though, right? So I'm in the stall, sitting down, trying to take a poo-poo. And who walks in? Friggin' everyone. Okay, not everyone, but like five kids. Like five kids. They're just I'm not even gonna say. But no one no one I ever mentioned before. These were all elementary school kids. Though there was this one kid whose like last name was a certain pronunciation and we used to call him this certain name. But I don't want to say it. So anyway, I'm just like, oh my God, please don't F with me. Please don't F with me. Please don't F around while I'm trying to take this poo. Friggin' head comes into the stall. Ooh. I step, I just jump up and like pull my pants up really quick. They're all laughing. I pull my pants down and go back, try to poo again. <clears throat> Someone jumps over, looks over the stall like, ah! I pick up my pants again. Oh my God. Like I don't want anyone to see my pee pee. Like, oh my God, okay, they're gone. 
pull my pants down again. Start trying to poo. Two heads come under. People are bang. <laughs> Bring my pants up. <laughs> like, squeeze the poo in. Oh my God, man. They're gone. Pull the pants back down. Sit back on the toilet. All I hear, I'm just like, okay, I'm safe. All I hear is, ooh, nice butt. I jump up again. I pull my pants up. I didn't see this kid. This kid must have looked under there and I didn't even see. And like, at that point, I couldn't hold it anymore. It was a 50-50 coin flip. Is the poo going to fall out in the toilet or in the pants? And it fell out in the pants. I'm standing up and the poo came out and I'm like, just poo. I'm like, just poo, bruh. Just let it all out, let it all out. These are the things I can live without. Scream, shout. And then I kind of was just like, okay, don't poo it all out. Whatever, dude, just go back to class. I'm like, you don't even have time to clean this up. Teacher going to get mad at you if you're trying to be in here for like 20 minutes cleaning this. If you tell her it's going to be embarrassing. Yo, just go to class. It's like, what? Half an hour, 30 minutes till home time. You're good. Just stand there with the poo poo in your pants, pants, dude. So I go back to class and we do prayers at the end of the day. We do our oh Canada, our home and native land. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, Spiritus Sanctus. Blessed our Lord, thy womb, Jesus, and Mother Mary. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed our womb. Thou art forever, thy womb, young woman, Jesus, amen. I don't remember how it goes. Wait. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are days and forever shall be a world without end. Amen. I don't remember, man. It goes like something, but I remember I had to recite that thing and I was getting it so stupidly wrong and everyone kept laughing at it. And I was just like, dude, stop laughing. I'm trying to, I'm making my own prayer up, okay? Because I kept saying, blessed are thou, um, blessed, or like, no, I was like, blessed are thou among young women or some shit. And I was like, I kept saying something like, blessed are the young women or, or something. I, I don't remember. I mean, like, Bless the young woman. I don't remember what I was saying. I was like, all I remember was like, it was wrong. But the way it came out was like, I was like representing young women. Like I said it somehow like that. I was like, represent young women. And everyone was laughing at me because I was like, like I missed like a few words or like put put a word where it wasn't supposed to be the young woman part. And it, it just made it sound like I was like, bro, young women are the ish. Anyway, so yeah, we're all standing and I'm like, I wonder if it smells. And I could feel it. Every time I would sit back on a chair, it would be like <laughs> squishy, squishy, squishy and spiky. I remember there was like spikes in it. It felt like there was spikes in it. It was like hot spikes and squish. Like nuts. Who knows what was in it? And I was like squish, sat back down, get up. And it's just this like cushion of poo poo. It's like silicon. Like I had a big bum. I got like bum implants, but it was just poo. And then like, I don't know. I th it must have smelled. So we get, we get let out. And I guess I sit on the bus. Who knows? I don't see these parts. I don't remember. I don't remember how I got home, but I must have took the bus because that's what I was doing back then. Taking the bus or yeah, getting a ride. Who knows? I really do not remember. <laughs> it must have been a blur. I have no recollection of getting home and being like, Mommy, I put my pants. I must have tried to do it myself. I must have tried to clean it all secretly and did like a terrible job, but thought I was like slick with it. Mama probably found out and was probably like, he's probably super embarrassed. I'm just going to let him think that he got away with this. But that's what happened. I pooed. I pooed because people wouldn't let me. The people and the man was keeping the poo down. So I just pooed in the pants and stuck it to the man and said, hey, watch me now. Smell me. 
This poo could have been in the toilet in the sewage, but you had to let me not poo and I had to poo. And when you not let the boys poo and they have to poo, the poo's going to exit the bum into the pantaloons. And then it's going to be a squishy bum implant of hot, nutty poo in class. I felt super lucky that like we were like 10 minutes, 15 minutes from school ending. But holy, I was just like, damn. I literally poo pooed in the pants. Like I was forced to poo in the pants. Like I didn't just poo in the pants. So that's a claim to fame. I didn't poo like accidental poo. I pooed because, damn, I didn't want anyone to see my pee pee or my bum bum. And I didn't want anyone to see me pooping. So I pooed in the pants. I just, damn, I remember being like, can I reverse this? Can I pull down the pants and let the poo in the toilet? I'm like, I am not even going to, I didn't even pull that. Like I just picked up the pants and then I couldn't hold it anymore. And the, like within 10 seconds, the poo was just like releasing. I'm like, damn. And I just did the button up. I didn't even pull it back down to be like, <gasps> I was just like, nah, nah. It was like the knife is in, just leave it in. Just leave it in. So the blood <laughs> doesn't gush. Anyway, great times. That was like the only time in the world I ever pooed in the pants. Really, except as a baby pooing the diapers. Or I probably pooed in the pants when I was super, super small. Who knows? I peed in the bed like once or twice. Did I pee my pants? I have no recollection of peeing the pantaloons. But darn you heckin' kids. Stop looking under the stall, jumping over the stall, punching and kicking the stall. Holy. Like, that was a traumatic experience. Anyway, thank you and farewell. Let's dance in style, let's dance for a while Let me away, we're watching the stars Looking for the best, but expecting the worst Are we gonna drop the bomb?